the dough has been resting overnight and I'm going to turn it out onto this piece of baking paper. And there it is. So the first thing I'm going to do is to just brush off this old flour that's been sitting on the dough. We don't want that. Be gentle with it. And then I'm going to put some fresh flour on it. Uh, we have a choice. We have uh, brown rice flour here white rice flour in here. I even have uh, some middlings, as they're called, or you could use fine semolina. So today I'm just going to use this brown rice flour and I'm just going to lightly cover the top of the dough and then very gently just smooth it. Lovely. And then just brush off any excess. Then I'm going to take uh, my dough blade, my lamb as it's called, and uh, I'm going to cut a score along this part of the dough. So uh, here I'm going to have my blade almost vertical and then as I come to the top of the dough I'm going to turn the blade to a 45 degree angle and then just slice across it like this and then go back the other way just to make sure that it's evenly cut across. And then I'm just going to do a very simple little uh, ear of corn or spelt in here. And then just very lightly, I'm going to do the stalk like that. And it's ready to go. So I'm going to put it onto my peel, don my oven gloves, and my casserole. I'm using an upturned casserole. This has been heating in the oven for an hour. I'm going to put my bread in like that. And another little tip is to stop the crust from forming too quickly. Whoops. I'm just going to put an ice cube heart shaped appropriately underneath each end of the baking paper. And then as quickly as you can, put the lid on again and put it into the oven for 20 minutes.